My favorite drink is milk, okay? When I get the chance to drink milk, I will fucking drink milk, okay? When it's at that perfect temperature, milk is just the best drink in the world, you know? Uh, so that is just my opinion. Uh, it's also a fact, but you know, some people don't like milk because they're stupid and gay. But in this video, I'm not going to review milk, okay? Because you already know that milk is the best drink in the world. So I don't need to explain that to you once more, do I now? You fucking idiot. This video is more about how milk curses my life. It is a curse to my life, okay? Milk is a curse to my life. Not because I buy too much of it and it's expensive, because milk isn't that expensive. You know, you can buy a lot of milk for not that much money. No, no, nothing like that. Milk is something that I'm allergic to. So basically, whenever I drink it, I'm slowly building up bleed. You know how in Elden Ring, uh, when you get hit by a bleed weapon, your bleed meter goes up? Well, whenever I drink milk, my bleed meter also goes up until I fucking bleed out of my nose. That is correct. Milk causes me nosebleeds. I have never been officially diagnosed, but whenever I drink fucking milk, after a short while I will bleed out of my nose. It's either a pretty light bleed or it can be a heavy bleed that lasts up to 15 minutes. And you know what I do? I just keep on drinking milk. I just think to myself, well, it's fine if I get a nosebleed in a couple days. I don't care. I'm just going to keep on drinking milk. Who the fuck cares? And then when I finally get a nosebleed, I'm like, huh, I should probably stop drinking milk. But then I see milk and I'm like, huh, yeah, I'm probably just going to drink milk now. You see, it's kind of like an endless cycle. And it doesn't matter if my parents stopped buying milk because they tried to stop buying milk so I wouldn't drink milk anymore. But here's the funny part. At the place where I work, we have like a shit ton of milk. It's practically endless there. It's actually for old people because, you know, I work in a place where you take care of old people. But when something is nearly out of date, we don't uh, serve it to them anymore. So I can just drink it, which is uh, great. You know, that, awesome. But generally speaking, like when I drink a lot of milk, that's when I get the nosebleeds. When I drink a little milk, like one glass per week, I don't get nosebleeds. It's only when I drink a lot of milk. Now, a while ago, uh, one of these people uh, moved away from the elderly home. And uh, we had to clean the room so another person could move in, right? And I was cleaning with this one girl. And, uh, well, suddenly, my nose starts bleeding. And it's the worst nosebleed I had ever had in my entire life. And I thought, what the fuck? You're giving me this nosebleed now in this crucial moment of my life? It lasted like 20 minutes and it kept bleeding. And uh, eventually one of the doctors that worked there uh, had to like help me out with my nosebleed. It actually felt like it wasn't going to stop and I had to go to a doctor or something. But uh, that didn't happen. It eventually did stop when I followed the instructions like keeping my... Uh, my nose pinched or whatever the fuck. And, uh, you know, the finishing touch of that story is that, like, you would think that I would stop drinking milk after this, right? Like, I would completely stop drinking milk after this experience. But nope, I'm still going at it. So I don't care. Uh, and I'm going to keep on drinking milk. So thanks for watching and fuck off.